Hey, yo, it's me, Pops Fan Marmalade, and you're watching the Comics Related Madness Network. Uh-huh. So come get some. Cromcon. Cromcon. Fairview's coffee has mysteriously gone missing. Mayhem ensues when strange, coffee-craving zombies plague the city. Detective Mickey Potatoes, an overworked public servant, uncovers why ordinary citizens are losing their minds and how to stop the coffee apocalypse. But it involves the Mafia. And when you're dealing with Mafia crime families, nothing is ever easy. The Mafia controls everything in the city, including the police, including him. If he breaks the Mafia, they will break him. So, the city is without coffee. The city is burning before his very eyes, but he's powerless. Detective Potatoes has the power to stop the coffee apocalypse. But if he does, he could lose everything. And now for something completely different. What is up, everyone? Hell Comscape. 
How's everyone doing today? All right, uh, first few announcements. And then we'll get on with the... Uh, well, first, let's take a look at who's in the chat. What's up, Billy? Hail, uh, Ara, uh, please forgive me if I, uh, uh, butcher your name. How's it going? All right. <clears throat> so, a couple of announcements today. Uh, Crystal Legends, if you haven't heard, is on, uh, Fun My Comic, and it's only on Fun My Comic. Right now, we are at 69 days left. Uh, so, we reached the goal, but we'll get there. And another thing is uh, tomorrow at 5 p.m., I will be on. Uh, I'll be on the YouTube channel Unhinged. <laughs> Gable. <clears throat> so uh, tomorrow, five PM, I'll be on. Uh, I'll, I'll be on the YouTube channel show called Unhinged, where where I'll be talking with uh, Jason and a few others. Uh, what else? Oh, yes. Uh, I have set a, a poll on, <clears throat> on Twitter. And I'll put that in the, actually, yeah, you know, I'll just put it in here just in case. <clears throat> For, uh, the, uh, hats thing. Where, because, again, I'm having trouble deciding to whether or not do uh, the uh, snapbacks or the flex fit. So I need your all help, your all's help by voting uh, for one or the other. So it's. Put that in there. And also, if you're not back the uh, book yet and you want to get the new trading cards, back any physical product, and you will get the uh, trading cards, the new ones. So, without further ado, let's turn on some uh, StreamYard tunes, if we can. And let's get the show on the road. There's a soft share and screen.
Yeah, uh, go on my uh, Twitter page and put a vote down on on baseball caps with snapbacks or flexbit. Yeah. <laughs>
This creature has like no muscle at all. I don't know much about it. Only from what I've read. Guys, uh, I'll be right back. But in the meantime, we'll be back for like one minute. 
In the meantime, uh, enjoy a, uh, <clears throat> a uh, clip. this one. Is there one joining the weekend so far? Don says evening, and Don also says pretty uneventful and boring, which is not a bad thing per se. Not a bad, bad thing. It's not really a bad thing at all, really. It all depends on how you look at it. Yeah, yeah, really. It just kind of depends on how you look at it.
can hear the background, I'm sorry. Um, and this comic network, Bob's, says, I really have some excitement. And, yeah, excitement. Uh, uh, excitement is a lot, honestly, to me, is a lot better than being boring. Dating 
But sometimes, but sometimes it's also good to have a little bit of a beast too. I'll be mellow when I'm dead. <laughs> but yeah, excitement's better. What's up, Steven? How you doing, buddy? I'm doing all right. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with StreamYard. They wouldn't... The, the admin mail wouldn't go to Steven, so I have to make sure I'm out here to run the show because he can't control anything. Yeah. Somebody was messing with our layouts, man, because... Yeah, I don't like what... Somebody was in... Somebody in our network was in the studio messing with the layouts. And when you were doing the share screen earlier of your campaign it's like it was only on like a third of the screen man it was like it used to be a lot bigger than that i don't know who was messing with our layouts but i wish they wouldn't do that because it affects everybody in the network yeah you know uh don says i'm pretty sure i would i would be busy haunting folks after i die i won't be haunting folks they'll be they'll be coming more on that be trying to get me to talk to them just like they do on all these other TV shows now. There you go. I'm not gonna have to chase people around. People are gonna be trying to find me. I used, <laughs> I used to watch uh, uh, Ghost Hunters as a uh, kid. That's like one of the shows I used to watch. Aside from uh, instead of uh, my favorite cartoons and uh, and the occasional WWE. Yeah, I love I loved all the ghost hunt shows except except for that one goofy dude. That that like like college kid. I didn't like his because it was it always looked like they were staging the next event. It was like, come on, man. College kid? Huh? Which one are you talking about? I can't remember the name of it. It was the young kid that the college kid that was doing it too. Not the Ghostbusters guys, or not the Ghost Hunters, but some other show. Well, well, nowadays there's a, there's shows everywhere. Yeah, I know. Now there's like forty of them. <laughs> yeah. Well, well, main, well, mainly now they're on now they're all on YouTube, and then the people of YouTube who who go uh, urban explore, urban exploring, which if you don't know what that is, it's uh, exp it's uh, exploring uh, abandoned houses, buildings. Hospitals. So yeah. is this is this one of your demons from Crypts and Legends? <coughs> yes, this is a uh, cryptid called uh, a rake, right. and it's going to be it's going to be the green uh, card for uh, <coughs> for the Singer Chance campaign. A friend of mine suggested I do. Uh, a kind of a creature uh, uh, cards. So, that's what I'm doing. Uh, if I don't find a place to move to pretty quick, I'm going to have to wait for the third chance campaign. Fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> After the second chance campaign, I am moving on to, to, to uh, Rev and Issue 3. I just can't spend no money till I get settled. You know? Yeah. I've been missing out on a lot of them lately. Bumming me out. But, you know, it's no good. But, yeah. Uh, since, since we're in the middle of the show, I will say again uh, Crystal Legends is on Fun My Comic and only on Fun My Comic. And uh, don't forget to uh, go go to my Twitter page and vote snapbacks or flex fit for the uh, for the uh, bowl cat hats because apparently I can't decide. <clears throat> and also, I will be on uh, unhinged tomorrow at five. Engaged with our boy Jason Baskonio. 
Yeah. Y'all don't know Jason. Jason cool as hell. He did uh, Absolute. I think it's one of his books. I can't remember. Uh, Frog G. I think. I think it was. I think it was. And then he did Frog G. Some work with Frog G's book. And yeah, Jason's awesome. Yeah, I, I can't. I can't wait to be on his uh, on his show. I don't know what he wrote. My boy Luke, the death metal hero. <laughs> you don't know Luke, then you're way behind. <clears throat> so yeah. Uh, also, if there's any uh, show. Mm, you show I should uh, ask me. I should ask Beyond. Let me know. I'll, I'll, I'll see if I can get if I can uh, ask for a spot. Get the board out for uh, Crimson Legends. Get on every show you can. You know what? Yep. Oh, uh, first thing I just got a message saying removed from the team. Admin has removed you from the team. <laughs> yeah, I just went to send Brian admin for his show. Oh, so it's saying you were admin, but you're not? What the hell? Man, this stupid thing. StreamYard's really whacking today. Can't believe that shit. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Stream are just whacking, dude. Hey, hey, Fox, Fox. Who's that imposter there? I'm here. I'm here. You're here. We're here. Uh, who's that imposter there? <laughs> Keep rocking, bro. Yep. <clears throat> so it did give you admin, even though you never got the email. It's it said it said I, it said I was admin, <laughs> but I don't have access <laughs> to yeah. any of the videos on here. Yeah, streamyard's whacking. You know, at some point, I need I need to switch to I need to switch over to uh, what is it called, Melon? What? I don't know. It's this new thing that uh, that Dark Gifts is on. It's, uh, it's another uh, streaming uh, site called uh, Melon. Melon? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I, one, I only need one service as long as I go out to my eight destinations. I'm just fine right here. You know? <laughs> um. I just wish that street guard would would go to Rumble. They don't go to Rumble. I don't because I don't know how to figure that shit out. Why well, is Rumble anyway? Just another uh, like YouTube. A whole bunch of videos, <coughs> different channels, different people. I mean, the Mad Madness Network's over there, boy. I put like a thousand videos up over there and, and wasn't getting no. No action. It's, like, it's more of a political site, the way I look at it. They care more about, you know, um, what all the political people are saying than they do what comic people are saying. Yeah. Huh. This is coming along nicely, actually. Uh, 
<laughs> so yeah, currently I'm uh, also writing uh, issue three. And issue three, hopefully I, I hope I can keep it as uh, 28 pages. If not, it's going to end up being 30 again. I mean, call away. I remember. All right.
And is he back yet? <laughs> Stephen has been called away. There's not a whole lot of time left in his shows. I'll just play a few more commercials. Hopefully he'll get back out here before it's over. Bringing you sex, sass, and style. Buckle up and unlock your imagination for a fun adventure with these death-dealing dames. They sail the galaxy in search of spoils. The most dangerous acquisition, and the most fruitful, are the legendary Splinters of Yggdrasil. The Splinters are magical artifacts forged from the Tree of Life that wreak havoc on the universe. The missions are perilous, but the bounty is glorious. Enjoy our hyper-fictional wonderland. How is a pirate ship sailing through space? Cause magic. How do they heal so quickly after battle? Cause magic. How are they able to communicate through jewelry? Cause magic. It's all about the characters. Abo, rough, robotic, ready. Mo, carefree, callous, courageous. Mistress Graven, daring, diplomatic, dominating. Betsy, academic, accountable, aristocratic. Nefara, ancient, assured, adrenaline junkie. Brudo, proud, prominent, protective. Fisty, independent, incendiary, invigorating. Roxy, superficial, scarred, secretive. Once you get to know this diverse crew of mythical miscreants, you'll be anxious to find out what trouble they'll get into on the next episode. Go to abogrizzly.com and order both halves of the first episode today. I'm back. Sorry for that, uh... Oh. Let's uh, get back to drawing this. <laughs> we got a few minutes left. Oh. You know, you know, when it gets back to when it gets to uh, like <clears throat> I don't know, five or six minutes, then that's when I'll put pencils down. Uh, did you know that they actually made a movie on the rank? I did not know that. They did, and it's a horror movie, obviously. I want to thank everybody who watched tonight, who watches on the replay, who goes and backs Stephen's book, all that stuff. You know, we appreciate yeah. you. Please don't forget to uh, check to uh, check it out. And also, uh, I will be adding uh, Doc's uh, cover slash poster for Crimson Legends to the campaign once I have it. And also, uh, another thing. The uh, the original, uh, all the originals for issue one and two are also available on from my comic. So <clears throat> you'll be able to uh, have. The original, the original pieces that I worked on. Mm. 
here trying to light. When I say there will be light, there will be light. <coughs> I don't know. I think if you gave that guy like a bunch of puffy hair, he'd look just like Rich. <laughs> do I do like a uh, variant uh, card with this, except except just just have it with hair? Yeah, just make him a little hairier, and he look just like Rich. <laughs> The thing is with uh, elongated uh, uh, characters is that sometimes it's hard to uh, draw them. When they're uh, bent over like this. But the great part about elongated characters is that there's no scale to judge them by. That's also true. <laughs> it's, no, that's the way mine are. That's just the way they are. You know, um, that's where your own style gets gets to take a precedent and nobody can say, hey, man, that ain't right. Now. How do you know this? What do you mean it ain't right? The way it is in my world, dude. You know. Yep. And we are at the five minute mark. <laughs> All right, everyone. I want to thank everyone for, for popping in. Uh, don't forget to uh, go to my Twitter and uh, and vote. Snapback or FlexFit? Which is better? Because because that vote would uh, reflect on what hats. I get to put to put my logo on. <clears throat> also, don't forget uh, tomorrow at five p.m. I will be on Unhinge, talking. Um, I'm talking to uh, uh, Jason, and he'll probably also be on the draw stream at one o'clock. Yes, I yes I probably will. <laughs> Check it out. One o'clock tomorrow, the Madness Open Draw Stream. Then we have the show offs right after that. And then right after that, Stephen will be over there on Unhinged. So it's like a, a triple header. Dude. Yeah. And don't forget to button to go to Fun My Comic and back it. Back Curse and Legends. The second chance campaign. And then when and then once that campaign's over and everyone's uh everyone gets their books and the new and the new cards. I might as well show the other card too. That's not it. Hey, hey, pops, you, you ever get that feeling when you're un, when you're unprepared? Say what? I see you ever get that feeling when you're unprepared. Oh yeah. <laughs> I, I mean, you, know, you also get this training card too. I, I wasn't prepared to run this show, but here we are. <laughs> so, so if you back. So if you back any physical any physical item on Fun My Comic for Bullcast Studios, you will get these two trading cards. Now these two trading cards were originally supposed to go to the uh, sign up to the people who signed up, but since but since uh, I got a shadow band on Indiegogo, yeah, and and I, and I pretty much quickly just moved everything to Fun My Comic. I didn't have time to set to set up a uh, <clears throat> to set up a uh, mailing list. So for everyone who signed up, and for everyone who hasn't, you're gonna get these two cards. And I'm probably also gonna put these up for uh, for uh, backing on on for my comic as well. 
Uh, what else? Is there anything else I should mention? Mm, I think we covered it. <laughs> All right. Well, again, everyone, I want to thank everyone for for uh, for joining for joining us into the chat. I want to thank Paul for keeping the Kelpin down here, and mm -hmm. for, and for helping me in the uh, backstage due to uh, me not being able to somehow get the email. Yeah, I got you. No worries. No worries. Um, yep. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, tune in in about five minutes, and we'll be doing the Horror Movie Club with Brian Crisco and your boy, Matt Burt. Hello, everyone. Hello, Carlos Kate. And keep drawing. Keep having fun. And until next time, I'll see you later. Peace. How do you end this thing? How do you put the where there was the brakes on this bus? I forgot. Jazz hands. Jazz hands are Have dark. Good night.